Okay, we are inside Etsy and I wanna go to my purchases. So what you'll do is your account, you're gonna click the down arrow and then purchases. And it'll take you to every purchase that you've made on your Etsy account. So I make lots of Etsy purchases. We are gonna narrow it down by typing in mock-up. And because I also have an obsession with buying mock-ups, there are going to be a lot of mock-ups here. You can see that I've been buying tons of mock-ups, especially at the end of last year. Um, so I'm just gonna pick one of these mock-ups and show you how you download it to your computer and then upload it to Canva. But let's say that we want to download and create a mock-up using this red shirt. So you're going to click on download files. And then we have the mock-up here. I made multiple purchases that day, as you can see. So here's the red. It's a Gildan long sleeve. Click download and the download is going to start right down at the bottom of my screen. Once it is done downloading, then we can go to Canva. Let's just go to the home screen real quick. We're going to do custom size. I always do 2000 by 2000 for anything that I'm going to possibly end up using as an Etsy listing because that is the minimum size requirement for Etsy. Now on the sidebar, I'm going to go to uploads, upload files, and find that mock-up download. And so you'll see it's going to start the download here in just a second. Once it's downloaded, click it once, it will automatically go to your artboard and then you can and then you can drag the anchors on the corner to size it and fit your square. So some of this is going to be cut off. I'm okay with that as long as I get the main portion. And then the next thing you'll do is upload the design that you wanna to add to the shirt to create the mock-up. So I'm gonna show you how to make a complete mock-up in the t-shirt video. But I wanted to note that here on the sidebar, I have my Google Drive connected and there's tons of YouTube videos on how to connect your Google Drive to Canva. It's super easy. But when I download mockups, I will download them to my computer, then upload them to my Google Drive so I can keep them all organized and I can access them whether I'm on my computer, my phone, or even using my husband's computer. So that way I'm always able to access them without having to carry around a hard drive or anything like that. And then I can also access it from anywhere where I use Canva. So just a tip, I'll show you real quick what it looks like. This is my Google Drive, all the folders I have in my Google Drive, and I have a specific mock-up folder for all the mock-ups I've purchased. And then in that, I have all the different types of mock-ups. So drinkware, Halloween, onesies, paper, signs, sticker mock-ups, tank tops, and t-shirts. And then I just have some random ones here that I still need to probably organize. But that's how I try to keep everything organized. I also have a separate folder on my Google Drive for all the designs that I create. So at any time I can use one of my designs and one of the mock-ups I've purchased to quickly create a mock-up if I'm on the go.